Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. And today, I don't know what we're doing. I'm really sorry for the background noises. I'm in a car wash right now. I'm in Montana. As you know, living it up that life. Really happy. Shout out to me. We'll be at the end. You know who I'm talking about, you guys. So, I'm really stuffy today. My nose is kind of congested. No, I don't have corona, everybody says. So, um... I don't know why, but I was I was filming, but I wasn't filming. So, um, I filled out the dog's bowl, but it was off camera, but I pretended like I was filming. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I actually admire that I have my nails done. Oh, well. So, um, so I filled up Stitch's bowl, and they're both in different spots, because Stitch and Princess like to fight over their food. So, Stitch likes... Stitch likes to bug Princess, and then Princess gets a little aggravated, and Princess doesn't like Stitch getting all over her food and stuff, so they kind of just, we kind of have them separated, so Princess minds her own, and Stitch minds her own. Right now they're outside, because Princess is just, you know, uh, laying outside, I'll go show you in a second. But Stitch is also outside, probably underneath the trailer like he is. He always digs holes under there for some reason. Oh, almost dropped the camera. Mm. So, anyways, so yeah, I've been living it up that life. Uh, not anything too recent. Anyways, today's kind of going to be kind of like a day in the life, basically. So, it's kind of going to be um, fun and, you know, just showing you what it's like to be a car washer in summer. Uh, my friends are probably really going to miss me this summer because I've been in Montana every single year for, like, the past all day of my life. Like, every single day. Not every single day, but a summer. I used to stay up here for two months uh, with my uncle, my nana, and my papa. Usually it's just me that comes down here, so it's usually four to five people. But now my sister came down here, so no, it's more like five. Well, my uncle me, my nan and my papa, so usually there's four people if my sister and my brother don't come and my mom don't come, but my sister came, so now it's five people, so my sister is up at the terminal, she's usually, there's actually, is there a flight on the ground, uncle? Oh yeah, there is, yeah, there's a flight on the ground, you can't hear it, but um, they're having... It was delayed for some reason because of the weather. It is actually really cold. You can see my nose is red. That's why I'm kind of congested right now is because my nose is red. But, um, yeah. So, usually, usually I let the dogs out to go to the bathroom. And then, um, we kind of just, like, go on from there with the day. And, yeah. There's nothing much. I'm going into sixth grade. I am super excited. You don't know. The last day of school was really hard for me and i have no clue why so it was the last day of school i was super excited and it was the end of the day i was trying to not cry but i just couldn't i was gonna miss everybody and it was i gotta say it was the best year ever like i've ever had i know i'm crying on camera right now but i just can't last day of school my teacher, Miss Cooper, best teacher ever. I know everybody's going to start crying at home. All my friends that are watching this right now. Ugh, going to try to be happy. So, um, it was the last day of school, but my teacher, Miss Cooper, she was going around and she was hugging everybody. She was, we are like, kind of, the bells rung, and all the boys are just sitting in one corner and talking while well, all the girls are over here just crying. I think there was only one boy, I think, I have no clue, but I think there's only one boy that cried. I don't know who it is, but I just heard that one boy cried, and all the girls are over here in a pile, and, and I was with the boys. I was just talking, you know? And then I just came over and I saw everybody crying and I was like, what happened? And then I just start bawling my freaking eyes out and I just bawl my eyes out and I just start bawling and bawling and I don't know why, I don't know why, I just bawl. And then my two friends, Kylie and Addie, Addison, Addie, same thing, um, we were out and we, Miss Cooper hugged us all. She said, have a great summer. 
And then she said to me, she goes up to me and she says, each one of you are special. Each one of you. And we all leave out of the classroom. I say, bye, Miss Cooper. And she goes, bye, have a great summer. But and we're crying on all that, so it's very dramatic. Anyways, so me, Kylie, and Addison walk out crying. I, ha- I hug Livy. I hug Livy. And she goes, and I go, it'll be all right. We'll see each other next year. Hopefully we'll get the same teacher because we all want the same teacher. So, so, and then my friend Aubrey, she has to leave for the bus. So before this happens, she always hugs us and Jocelyn hugs us and everybody just hugs us. So we're just super sad for the people who don't go on the bus like Jocelyn and Aubrey. We say goodbye to them first and they're just the first ones Like, we're sad. Like, that's when it hits us. We're sad. I know you guys probably want to skip out on this part because I'm usually just talking. But it's fine because I kind of have to stay in here because it's cold. So, anyways, so we get out. Jocelyn and Aubrey leave to go to the bus. They're probably bawling their eyes out, too. I've never seen Jocelyn cry. So I'm like, oh, my geez. This is sad. Like, that's when it hits me. It is sad. So then I go ahead and I kind of just like, I go out, I walk out with Kylie and Aubrey and they have to go in car line because their mom and their dad picks them up. Kylie has to go with her brother and her brother is behind and uh, Kylie's brother is behind her. So we're walking out, we go past the car line and we see these sixth graders. And I feel so bad for sixth graders because sixth graders are leaving elementary. So we're like, oh my God, this is sad because I'm in sixth grade now. So this is how hard it's gonna be next year, but even harder because we're gonna miss our teachers and all the sixth graders. We're hugging Miss Pearson at the, our art teacher at the thing. And we're like, oh my gosh, this is so sad because we were crying as well. We were like, oh my gosh, this is so dramatic. <laughs> so we were leaving. Me, Addison, and Kylie were going down the thing, and we could not leave each other. Kylie had, Addis, Addie had to go because her mom was in the car line. So we just stand there in a circle like this, and we we're just telling everybody, <coughs> <coughs> it was gonna be okay. You got this. You're all right. You know what I mean? Saying encourages word. Get this pumped up. Yeah. So. We were doing that, and I just, I could, my heart dropped. Like, I was supposed to be at innovation. Like, I was late. My mom works there. And I'm like, I don't care. I don't care if I'm late. I want to stay. Like, I couldn't let him go. So, Addie had to go. So, her mom, so her siblings came over. And I saw me and Kylie, when Addie left, me and Kylie saw Livy again. And Livy's bigger sister was like, it's all right, it's all right. And Livy's little sister ran over to me and she's, it's okay. And she started crying too because Livy told a whole bunch of us, like Livy tells her little sister about us. So, we're like, aw, we miss her so much. You know what I mean? That's what Livy's little sister was like. And I was like, oh, I'm going to miss you too. So it was sad. And me and Kylie just sat there for a while. We started drifting apart a little bit. But I had to go. She had to go. It was the end of the day, end of the school year. And we were sad. Like, that was it. So we started slowly, slowly drifting apart until we both, both knew at the same time we came running back to each other and we just hugged and we said that's it I'm gonna go now and I walked away from her and I saw Livy one more time and she said bye Hazel I'll see you next year saddest point in my life right now I have no clue why I started crying I have no clue how I did this no clue I had how I did that but it's fine it's sad now probably everyone's crying at home get a tissue I know I know it's sad but so now we're kind of gonna do since I've been talking for like eight nine minutes now the camera says now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to go outside and I'm gonna show you the pups sorry my hand was in the way there so I'm gonna show you the puppies so the really funny thing it's sunny but it's cold out I have this leather jacket on 
There's my princess. Aw, oh, babies. Yeah, so, okay, so my uncle set up this tiny little, like, tiny, literally so tiny, orange chair. And I'm gonna sit in it. Do you know why I'm gonna sit in it? Ow. I'm gonna lean back and I'm gonna go falling back. Then you're gonna, look at how close I am to the ground. Literally, my knees. So I'm kinda just gonna sit out here. Should have sat out here a long while ago, but it's hot and cold at the same time. Well, you should see the new shirt I got. It's nice. So usually right now I just kinda play around. We usually have no cars to wash right now <coughs> because planes come in and there's not a lot of people who are coming in. Usually before the planes we get like a lot of, I can see you creeping up back there. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know where Stitch is. He, nope, he's right there. So now Princess gets in my way of the camera and she starts being all little pin pin, huh? Yeah. Ew, no, don't. No, absolutely not. So, and then I just get loves from her. And then, that's great. It really is great. So and then I stand up because I, my knees are cramped as heck. Yeah. So yeah. So fun. And then my uncle just asked if the phone's at 100% because last time I was filming and it died on me and I couldn't post it because then I would have to do a second part and I just love just like finishing it off. So yeah, it's pretty fun. It's usually how my day goes. I'm not gonna make this like an hour long, but you're gonna hear a lot of background noises because here's a car wash pad. That's where I'm washing cars. It's kind of empty right now, but my uncle's pulling in a car right now. I gotta get out of the way. I'm gonna get hit. So yeah, uh, not much we're gonna do. I'm gonna, uncle's gonna say hi. Uncle, say hi. Hi. That's uncle. So yeah, there's not much. Uncle usually plays around with me. I'm gonna go see if I can find Stitch. Princess is locked up because we usually when people come to ask, like, you know, Princess always barks at them. So we always, whoa, that's echoing. Okay, I don't like that. Come on, Stitchers. So I found Stitch. He was in the back of the trailer, or under the trailer, I shall say. So, now, have my tiny orange chair. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm bored, I don't know what to do. Usually not a lot we do here. I usually just go up on my iPad, play some Roblox, you know, and you pooped in the middle of the road. Middle of the walkway, Stitch. I'm gonna step on the poop. Anyways, Princess Stitch just decided he was going to poop in the middle of the walkway. <coughs> I cleaned it up after the video, it's just disgusting. So yeah, not much. All my friends are probably like super excited to see my face right now because they haven't seen it in a billion years, literally. That's what it feels like to me. Like it feels like it's been a million years. And then I don't know how to explain that, but it just feels like it, you know? So, yeah, not much going on. I think I'm going to end this video right here. I hope you guys liked it. And shout outs, it's time. It's time. It's time. So we do a Western play. Not going to start it. Oh, my gosh, I'm going to keep talking and talking. So, anyways, so I'm going to end this video right here. Let's do the shout outs. Shout out goes to Livy Larson. Aubrey Brown, Devin Dixon, Kyla Bustamante, Audrey Dinnerman. I can't read. Addison, Addie, Addison, Addie, and Mercedes McCoy. MJ and MJ's little cousin. 
So guys, shout out to you. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.